How's it going, everyone? My name is Lori Plays, and welcome to the crime. This is case one, which is a cool naming scheme. Each chapter is basically going to have its own case. But this is made by a bunch of talented people that I will leave down below. It also featured someone named Jason Blackheart as the main publisher of the mod, and I can't wait to actually give this a try. It's kind of like a, a street themed kind of gang vibe uh, mod. As you can see by the splash screen here, it's also very amazing. It looks incredible. The art style is very good. The polos look very well made to fit the theme. But before I st press this button, like, once again, we're so close to 10K. I don't even think it's 100 subscribers left. So if you enjoyed, please subscribe. And without further ado, let's just go right in. Okay, as you can see, this one actually has a bonus. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go through each polo first, then do the bonus and then do a mix. Simple as that. Let's start with this. Let's go. The first beat. Let's get it. If you turn up the the volume too loud, you get like this fuzzy, in my left ear, you get like this fuzzy sound. The polo looks sick though, the eyeball, one of them being like a fake eye is sick. I like how that last one is offbeat. On purpose, by the way, it's probably done on purpose. I could tell when it's intentional because it could have been like. <laughs> See, it's just one. What would you call it? One bar? No, it's like, a, you'll know what, it, what, I, what I mean. It's not a bar, but it's like half of a bar, a quarter of a bar ahead of where it should be. Okay, okay. Simple is good in this case because it's hip hop themed. It's going to have a lot of old school percussive instruments, which is great. The design with the dreads as well, though. Cold, cold. Interesting choice of like instrument it, it literally just is someone's mouth doing that but that's gonna be very interesting to be used with other stuff later in the recording so i'm pretty excited so far the beats i love the beats <laughs> Ooh, that's some heavy hit Oh my god, yeah, no, that, this polo's fire. Wow. Okay, wait, so the beats are, like, they're actually good. You know, the thing with hip-hop is, you can't really go too crazy with the beats because it's hip-hop. And uh, you need to keep them quite simple so that they have a bigger effect when listened to with all these other things like effects, melodies, and vo vocals. So, those were the beats. Am I going to give them a 10? Probably not. I'm again. I'm gonna give it a nine uh, because I noticed. I noticed there's a bit of a mixing issue. I'm not sure if that's intentional, but um, the beats in general they weren't really too loud, and I assume that's to make room for these other elements. So we'll see how it goes. Let's go into the effects. That's a disgusting bass. Oh! Okay, okay, that, that bass, that bass went crazy. Wow. This is why I like having a bass in, in effect one, because effect one is usually the effect that makes you go like, whoa, whoa, this is going to have impact. Shot fired. He's running, he's running, he's running. Roger that, roger that. Shot fired. He's running, he's running, roger that. 
Okay, simple enough. It doesn't need anything else, to be honest. That's kind of like a background vocal effect. Um, yeah, again, to use in the background. And then, because obviously this is a crime, street theme mod, hip hop, rap, you know, guns, crime, all of that stuff is going to, it sells the atmosphere is what I'm trying to say. Blow. Uh, yeah. Skrr. <laughs> Blow. Uh, yeah. Skrr. Nah, whoever made that had fun. I could tell whoever made that had fun. Just the stereotypical rap sounds that you hear now in like every single rap song. Uh, Ad libs, essentially. Interesting polo. I love the SWAT design, looks very clean. It looks very well designed, whoever made this. The gun as well. Nice attention to detail. I love that so much. It's a very unique sounding effect as well. So far, I have no complaints whatsoever. Um, and I think all of this will sound great. Even just the beats and effects alone, you could probably cook up with a le le legit alone. Okay, so again, we have more ad libs here to use as background kind of atmosphere. Uh, again, it gives off that hip hop vibe, very old school, uh, because modern hip hop wouldn't really have that kind of thing anymore. Uh, but overall, beats and effects together already very nice, very nice, and I can tell you'll be able to use them. There hasn't been a single polo so far that has been insanely jarring to listen to, which I appreciate a lot melodies are gonna be interesting though this is like the main bread and butter so if this isn't good then the hip-hop's gonna be a bit janky yep there you go like i said from the very first polo the melody is fire it gives off the hip hop vibe perfectly with the, I don't know what that instrument is called. It's, it's got like, again, a lot of percussive instruments. There's also, if you hear very closely and if you have headphones on, you can hear that there's someone going like, Ooh, very slightly in the background, which gives it a lot more of an impact than you'd think. Okay, so they went with a minor key, clearly, in all of this, to be, which makes sense, by the way. A minor key means it's usually a lot darker sounding, it means it's a lot more dramatic sounding, which makes sense with the whole street vibe and crime in general. <laughs> This is an interesting polo because it's it's very unique because it's just a broken down kind of like vocal sample, which works. It's going to work. I just don't know if I enjoy it compared to the first two as much. We're going to have to see once I put the effects and stuff like that against it. Melody 4. Again. The polo designs, by the way, for every single one of these was incredible. I can imagine putting like a drill beat or something like that over this, any sort of beat. Boom, 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 boom. Yeah, whatever. I'm acting all cringe. Stop acting cringe, please. Uh, yeah, no, actually. Okay. 
But no, that was fire. That was fire. If you throw beats on it, effects on it, it's going to sound really good either way. So let's get it. Let's get it. The final melody. That sounds good. Considering Incredibox is all about using um, vocals, really, vocal stuff to make all these different elements. That sounds really damn good. Melodies, all in all, incredibly usable. Incredibly usable. Every single one of them. My favorite is probably Melody 4. Just because it's got like that flute sound. I don't know what it is, but when it comes to like hip hop and rap, when you hear a flute in that genre, it hits different. I'm not sure if you know what I mean. If you do, comment down below. All right. We have one more thing left to cover, which are the voices. The voices could be anything. They could be the choir. They could be rapping vocals, which I hope there are some, by the way. I bloody hope there are. If this is a rap or hip hop theme mod. I'm not going to say anything else. I just want to see him. Let's go. I got bad. I, I, I got bad memories of them all accusing me. Pointing fingers when they, they know it fat. No, 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 in fat. They know it fat. No, no, that I'm innocent. I got bad. Oh, that you're innocent. Those were good vocals, actually. <laughs> what? That took me by surprise. Have you realized that in this mod, every single polo for like the first one of each type, it just has the biggest effect when you listen to it. I don't know what that is, but that's cool. I like that. They've done it like that. Oh my god. That sounds really good. That almost sounds tragic, if you know what I mean. Like a dr tragic, sad ending that, that you could use that polo for. I like that one. I actually enjoy this one. Hey, hard living, this life put a mic all in it. Walking a road full of bad memories, with my heart on my sleeve, wants the scars on it. Might as well go and shoot for the stars. Tell me what's crying if you can't put a star to it. You why there were villain, no hero, no lies in the middle when walking the street all alone. Hey, oh my god. Spit. He's actually spitting. I wasn't expecting that level of flow from an Incredibox mod, but here we are. There's a lot of other mo like street themed hip hop mods that I have left to cover. But I can see why people enjoy this one the most. This is probably the closest you're gonna get to a legitimate experience when it comes to hip-hop at the moment. Uh, I'm curious about vibing and hookers as well, but uh, so far I think this is on the podium at the top. We'll see if vibers and hookers can compete. I, I just don't think it would with that vocal there, then and there. Uh, another sick vocal that glitches up. Do you know how sick this is going to sound? Like a, a drop? So what I'll do is something like a drop. Build up to a drop. Then just into this with the rapping. That's going to go so hard, you won't believe it. This bonus is so good that you could use it by itself and it would be fine. Let's get into this bonus. Very curious. Very curious to see how this all sounds together. All right, three, two, one, let's go.
in a row, feeling bad memories. Put my heart on my sleeve, all the scars on my sword going sh- Hold up. <laughs> oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> Whoever did the vocals for this is uh, crazy. Whoever cooked up the beat is crazy. This is going to be so cold. That bonus was so... Sh- it, it probably wasn't short, but I was so shocked that it felt like it was short. Do you ever have that when you're enjoying yourself to the point where it feels like something that lasted 20 minutes felt like five? That's basically what that felt like. I enjoyed that bonus so much. I thought, you know, hip hop is going to be a terrible quality mod. It's not going to be very good. But now I see why people are raving over this. Holy. Again, whoever did this vocal needs a need something, some kind of Grammy or something. That guy can spit bars. That guy like, can actually spit bars. So my thoughts overall in this mod of my initial impressions so far is 9.5 out of 10. It's been so well crafted over time. And I know people were very excited for this to begin with. And they managed to deliver on every aspect, I'd say. I'm not sure if you feel the same, but I feel like they cooked up almost a masterpiece here. Again, the only thing missing is probably some of the mixing, which I didn't pay attention for that I should have, for the effect, uh, the melodies and the voices. But just from the raw sound of it, it feels like it's well mixed. The only 0.5 is like, my personal tastes at that point which objectively shouldn't even be in the way so honestly most of you guys at home are probably gonna say this is a 10 out of 10 like no questions asked okay so again as always before we get into this mix subscribe i think this is the third time of me asking if you made it this far type um my driller in the comments my driller to show me that you've made it this far into the video uh, again, let's just get right into the mix. I really want to cook something up that's gonna leave an impression, that's for sure. So yeah, I'll see you guys after the mix. Boom. Connie, you can't put a stop. Do what you want, they were villain. No hero, no lies in the middle. We're walking the street all along. 
walk in the world full of bad memories But my heart on my sleeve wants some scars On him I just wanna go and shoot for the stars Tell me what's crime if you can't put a star To it you either were villain No hero, no lies in the middle And walk in the street all alone Hard living, this life put the mic all in it Walk in the world full of bad memories But my heart on my sleeve wants some scars Tell him I just wanna go and shoot for the stars Tell me what's crime if you can't put a star To it you either were villain No hero, no lies in the middle And walk in the street all alone And that was Incredible to Crime. Uh, I, I made a bit of an oopsie near the start when I was mixing, but I think I got the hang of it the more I kind of did it because hip hop is built different to a lot of the genres I've been doing recently because you don't just switch it up on every loop. You want to switch it up every two loops with hip hop. Let me explain why. Because each of these bars finishes after two loops essentially so you want to do the full two loops before you do any change usually uh you could probably make one after one loop if you were very creative but i didn't cook with the one loop changes so the moment i realized that it's better when it comes to hip-hop at least to change it every two of those loops that were happening the mix sounded a lot better so Overall, a 9.5 from me. I don't think my opinion is going to change what is lacking or what I would add in this case is probably some more beat variations and some more impactful melodies because some of these got lost behind in the mix. So uh, yeah, that would be it from me. As always, I'll leave the link to this down below in the description as well as who made it so that you guys can try it for yourselves. But apart from that, if you enjoyed, smash the like button, comment down below with your thoughts about this mod. Did you enjoy it? Did you agree with what I what I said about it? And I'll see all of you guys next time with Spongle. We're gonna be Spongling hard. Peace out.